Everybody remembers Khalil Ware, how hyped up he was. And Khalil Ware is that like prototypical size. You'd think because he is seven foot with a seven foot seven wingspan at 242 pounds, this guy would be a lottery pick. Well, he was when he first came out of high school, was projected. Now, after somewhat of a tumultuous college career, he's at this point, he's a guy who's going to be 21 during his rookie season in 30 games this year 32 minutes a night shot 59 percent almost from the field 42 percent for three 10 rebounds about almost two blocks a game just under two assists a night 16 points the guy's got great rim protection i think he's gonna fly off the board kind of like Derek lively did due to that length and he's got good athleticism for being a seven footer he's got great shot mechanics good efficiency and he's shown efficiency efficiency around the rim and passing ability and i think the impressive thing is his agility and footwork for being a seven footer like he displays like discipline avoiding fouls and the guy seems to be very coachable completely changed his role when he went from oregon to indiana he's a double double machine the guy's a pick and roll god can be a rim runner but then he can also be a pick and pop guy also besides all this three-point shooting and like three and d ability he's like got some throwback post-up game and can be a little bit of a passer out the elbow and low post now he's not going to be a switchable defender he can be very in inconsistent and like physicality is needed i think the other thing is is like he's been criticized for soft lacking community lacking effort and communication like one nba executive told hoops i that his first year at Oregon, he was very soft and play hard, didn't say much. Now at Indiana watching his film, he feels like he's playing a lot harder. They haven't won much because some of the other guys they brought in haven't worked out, but he's held up his part of the shot. He blocks shots, caught slops, made a few shots, shown how he can step away from the basket. I think there's a guy there and you know, he gives you a twenty and ten game in college. I think there's a good there's a good pro you know, thing to work with there. And I think that's the type of guy you want in the NBA. And I think if he does a good showing at the combine, he's going to fly up those boards, ladies and gentlemen. So I want to hear your thoughts down below. What do you guys think of him? I've seen him go as high as 14 and other places might not have, don't have him ranked.